Hello everybody, this is Gentex Guy here, and in this video, I'm going to be testing the thermal portion of my System Sensor i3, as well as showing off a couple of new devices I've gotten. To the left of the detector, I have a Siemens U MHU MCS. This alarm is commonly confused with the Siemens U MMT. The main difference between the two is that the U MMT can do multiple different tones, but the U MHU MCS can only do one. Also, the UMHU MCS has a slightly higher pitch than the UMMT. Above the panel, I have a Simplex 4903 9236. This alarm is currently on the same box that the SmartSync module was on in my previous video. For some reason, this 9236 has a higher pitched horn than most of the other 9236s I've heard. And also, yes, I am aware that it's not supposed to be mounted vertically, however, this was the only way I could mount it on this box. Finally, in the panel, you can see that the wiring has changed a little bit. This is because I wanted the 9236 and the UMHU MCS on different circuits. The 9236 is wired into the NAC, which is being coded to code 3. For the UMHU MCS, I T-tapped the resettable power so that it could be used for the UMHU MCS and the i3. The positive end goes directly to the UMHU MCS. The negative end goes through the alarm relay first, then to the UMHU MCS. So this basically creates a second knack. However, this will make the UMHU MCS continue to sound until the panel has been reset. To test the i3's thermal sensor, I'm going to be using this hair dryer. The hair dryer will be about one foot away from the detector, and it will be on the low setting in order to avoid damaging the plastic. Alright, here we go. Thank you all so much for watching and have an awesome day.